Cheers. Here's the full dramatic relationship timeline for Eileen and Eddie. Whatever. Bye. Eileen and Eddie meet on the set of A&I and instantly attract. Have you met anyone yet? Oh, I'm kind of into Eddie. I love women like her. Never have ever had a crush on someone in the house. Oh. I know some of y'all got to put a finger down. Come on. Eddie! 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 Eddie. 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 Go ahead, speak. Um, I think Eileen's um, kind of like more attractive towards, I'm more attractive towards Eileen in this house. Sure. Oh. oh my gosh, I'm so happy he is talking about me because, man, is he fine. Now it's time to make a move. What's your favorite Mexican candy? Uh, those lollipops? Which ones? They have like the chile, like over them. You like those? Those are cute. I, I, I think I've, I've been told it kind of tastes like that. Wanna give it a try? Yeah, why not? <laughs> it's getting hot in here, for real. Yeah, what I taste like, what I taste like. What, what can you say? It tastes like candy. Candy? Yeah. Yeah. Eddie starts getting close to Maddie, and Eileen is not having it. Maddie's being kind of two-faced right now, and honestly, it's pissing me off. You know what's starting me off? He's talking to another girl. I don't know, dude. Literally, stop. I don't want... What? Kiss who? If you're not trying to make a move on me, f it, I'm gonna go to Maddie. You want me to kiss her? I can kiss her. You're shady. What do you mean? I'm not gonna let that comment go, by the way. What do you mean? The one what that you comment? made about kissing. Um, what's her name? I mean, you were the one that told me, go ahead and kiss her, and I said, yeah, I'll go ahead and do it. Hmm. Did you do it already? Maybe off camera, yo. Uh, all right, this conversation's over. Didn't make a move fast enough. Just when it seems like Eddie and Eileen are doomed, a last-minute date night brings them back together. You are now under arrest, and you will be going on this date now with this Eddie. Is the day. Hey. And as your host, please follow me to your table, babe. I can't stand some of these people in this house. You don't think before you talk, just like. Yeah, I think so. No, I. Or like I, you react too, too aggressive. Much. Yeah, yeah. And then you just dig your own hole, and then everybody else just kind of like notices that, and it's not a good look. She is straight up, and that's what I love about her. If there's a problem, I want to talk to somebody so the problem can be fixed, and that is what Eileen is. She's real. I feel like you've been like so, like off these past couple of days. And it's not a good look. When Maddie and Coley interrupt, Eddie's attitude takes a 180. <laughs> you guys, we're just Coley. Hey guys. There you go. He could have like just said, you know what, I don't want to do this right now, but instead he totally just like grabbed the sign and threw it and like it hurt my feelings. It really did. Eddie decides to apologize to Eileen, but it doesn't go as planned. I just want to like start off like, you know, like I'm sorry about last night. I totally forgive you. Like I know I understand now I now seeing it, like I understand you were upset and like it wasn't like a good time yeah. for any of that. And honestly, I think it's better if we just our like, friends. our friends. Yeah. yeah, I think it's better if we just... Yeah, just friends. Looks like these two will be living in the friend zone. For now. Maybe if you wanted to kiss me as friends too, I'd still be down. Eileen throws a party, and guess who makes the invite list? Did you have fun? I had fun. I met your friends, you know, came over. Weren't they a fun time? Yeah, I had fun. I, I actually really did have fun. Like, I'm glad you got to meet my friends. I feel like that's like a step in a relationship. Do you consider us like talking or like? I see us going like further on, but like you think we gotta, you know, the steps in the relationship. You do the talking stage, and then you go on the date. So yeah. and then you go meet a the date. <laughs> yeah, like what about we go on a date and just like, that would be talk. cute. Let's talk about it. Okay. Oh, that's sweet. Let's see where it goes. I'm excited. Takes me back to the hot tub days. Eddie sets up a romantic surprise for Eileen. Watch out, because there's a cord right there. Watch out, watch out, okay, watch okay, out, watch wait, out. Am I so, I did something for you. Okay. You guys, little movie date. How oh you feel? my god, how cute. Movie Is this date? a projector? Yeah, we got, got the movies out. Eileen, you are my dream date. Come on. Oh, I love it. Cheers. Cheers, Cheers yeah. for a movie night. A movie night. But Eileen has a surprise of her own. The other day, a fan ratted you out. No way. To me. Oh, they, say. they sent me a picture of you, um, and there's two, three other girls, and they're all kissing you. I mean, that was just a party, and you know, when you go to a party, you see your other friends. Those are, those are just my friends. Well, 
I feel like there's a lot of pressure when it comes yeah. to me and you. And I, I feel it every time we're together. I think what it is is just like the social media sees us together and like sometimes like they want to see like a thing work out but you know sometimes it won't or sometimes it's just mm -hmm. like who knows like we don't yeah i mean I, anything no can pressure, happen in the future like, yeah we don't like, have you know, you know what i mean I feel just like taking you know. it slow though we'll take yeah. it slow like, like there's no pressure like, for yeah. us to like be together yeah. but i mean as for right now i mean we're here right now yeah. so might as well just Let's, enjoy yeah we'll enjoy it that we we'll have put, on a, put on a movie watch a movie okay i'm kind of so. scared because i really don't like scary movies this is a good movie i love scary movies Eileen is still a little unsure about Eddie, so she turns to her family to get some advice. No, I'm not gonna have an update you guys. I know, what's, what's your update? So I know, for real, what's going on? Just about like, boys, you know? Oh my God. <laughs> it's kind of like, just a little bit weird now. Um, I don't know. Like we're not in a relationship, but then also he's kind of like. So were you ever, did you ever like identify like, oh, we're in a relationship? No. Did he? It's kind of weird, no. I also sure. told Eileen that she's too nice. Now sometimes she's too nice to these guys. Remember what I told you the other day? That you need to be a bitch. Be a too. mean bitch. Madre, ¿usted qué cree? Porque el muchacho como que se puso raro con ella. Yo pienso que ella es que eso está mal porque ella está bonita y está para escoger, no para que le escojan. Period. Yeah. Learn how to respect yourself and how to know that you are valuable and that if somebody doesn't value you, then you need to cut them out. Period. That's it. That was the answer. Eileen gets ready for a photo shoot, but her co-star Eddie is running late. Hello. Hello. Hey, where are you? I'm stuck in traffic right now, but I'll be there probably like another, give me like another hour. There's so much traffic, so I'm like just stuck in here waiting for the car. An hour? It's just like... I guess if I was more of a priority, he would be there, like, an on point. Okay. Whatever. Bye. Eddie finally shows up to the shoot. I'm sorry I'm late. I'm sorry I'm late. What's up, guys? What's up? Hey. I'm sorry I'm late. You look beautiful. You look beautiful. Thank I'm you. Sorry. Finally you're here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Míralo, Aileen. Míralo. Aquí está pasando algo. Mm. No hay conexión, no hay química. She's no saying hay... that there's no yeah, chemistry. I know. That is not what you want to hear. Right now, at this moment, I do definitely feel like it's just a job and I have to work to keep it. It's not like anything natural and I just feel like it's not going to go anywhere good. There's like a level like as a human, like you just don't like do something to like hurt them. Why do you on camera, you act like an to me, but like behind the scenes, you know, you obviously still want something to do with me, like you just play me. I feel like I don't deserve that. Eileen starts noticing Eddie's red flags. I just hate going on Instagram. Uh -huh. People send me pictures of Eddie with other every single time. Oh, really? Look it, literally. That's why I'm not even surprised, look it. Wow, like that, that's messed up. Yeah. I'm not the type of person to have like an issue with someone and just let it be. Like I need to squash it basically. Squash or, it or like get, like, get closure. Literally just with everybody in my life right now, that's what I need. Like, like if you want to suck stupid, lose you, that's his fault, you know? Mm. Eileen makes a tough call. Eileen? Hey. I've been thinking about it and I think it'll be better if we just stay as friends. I mean, I, at least right now, I don't really see us going anywhere, and I feel like we've tried, or at least I've tried, and it's just not getting anywhere, and I feel like we're just wasting time with each other. Like, we just need to have our own space and do our own thing for now. But I mean, I don't hate you. I, like, of course, we're still close, you know? Yeah, if you ever need me, sure. I'm still here for you, but other than that, like, I just think it's better if we're just friends. No, I still love you, nothing. Still friends, you know, we're still good friends, so I mean, that's, that's all it cares. That's all it matters to me. Yeah. Just like one last piece of advice. If you ever do decide to get in a relationship with someone, just make sure you're not posting other bitches because it really sucks, okay? Uh, yeah, all right, all right. Eileen is keeping it real. All right, Eddie, well, I'll catch you later. Some people just aren't meant to be. Do you think that's the last of Eddie and Eileen? Let us know in the comments below.